Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Talk. Wow. So today I was thinking about something that happened several years ago. I was about uh, 11 or uh, 12 years old. So I was still in primary school. And I received a letter from a girl who wanted me to be the boyfriend. So, uh, you know, I'm born and raised in the village. And uh, during those times, uh, the only language you would use to communicate was our mother tongue. Only uh, people in upper classes, like class six, class seven or eight, uh, were getting used to speaking uh, in, in English or uh, Kiswahili. So I received a letter from a girl uh, written purely in, in the Luo. <laughs> so it, it, it went like uh, Aheri Aduaroni Mundi Be Akwe Aheri Akwe Yusiep Aduani Mundi Bedo Siepna. <laughs> so that would translate to I love you and I would want you to be my friend then now she goes she goes on and on and on uh, throwing uh, praises here and there and uh, declaring her interest in me and wanting me to be the boyfriend <laughs> so I was still very innocent I was still very naive uh, and uh, she knew me, but I didn't know her. I couldn't recognize her. Uh, so she said that uh, she had seen me when we had gone uh, for sports in their school. Yeah. So uh, she knew me very well, but I didn't know her. She knew me. She knew where I came from, but I didn't know you. Like you're just receiving a letter, uh, but. Again, this is a girl asking you to asking me <laughs> to be the boyfriend. So I was very uncomfortable. I didn't know where I could uh, where, where to start from. I didn't know how I could approach that because in all my life until then, I hadn't approached a lady. I didn't <laughs> know how to <laughs> even uh, uh, ask a, a, a girl out. So I asked the, the lady that um, she had sent to at least get to know, I, to figure out if I can uh, recognize her. So I, even after all that, I couldn't. But she told me where the girl was coming from. And apparently where she was coming from is the same route we follow going to the market. Well... And I said, now what am I going to do? Because she knows me, I don't know her. I can't even go to the market comfortably because uh, we might um, meet coincidentally. And if we do, I didn't know how I could approach uh, the situation. I, I didn't know what I could even tell the lady. So <laughs> I had to, <laughs> to change my route to the market. Now, instead of following the road, I had to follow the bushes and uh, find out uh, shortcuts, discover new shortcuts. Now, this brings me to my question today to you ladies, to any lady watching this. At what age did you discover men? That is question one. Question two, uh, have you ever hit on a man? Or can you ever hit on a man that you like? <laughs> so, I, you know, I couldn't understand. I couldn't figure out how much courage this girl had. And I, I, now, I, you know, th that innocence and you, you feeling so excited and so anxious. Now, I didn't know what to do. So I started asking a few close friends, uh, what would you do in my situation? If you were in my situation, uh, some are like, a girl should not approach you. A girl should not, it is you to approach the, the, the girl. So I was like, eh, now then, 
this must be a very dangerous lady. But it turns out the, the girl was so innocent. She, she was also just acting on her. Uh, she was following her heart. <laughs> so today, you ladies, you tell me, can you ever approach a man? Can you ever hit on a man? Or have you ever hit on a man? And when did you discover uh, men? <laughs> I think me, I'm a, I'm a late bloomer. So <laughs> I was so, so innocent. Anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, like, uh, subscribe, and share. And uh, on the next episode, I said on the next episode, it's going to be so lit. Because we said this channel will be talking about... Um, things that we normally wouldn't want to talk about for fear of being judged or fear of being misunderstood and on uh, as we continue about the talk about dating and relationships this next episode we wanted to talk about lgbtq plus i know through uh, stones will be thrown but now we have to address this issue and if you are a member of the LGBTQ community, you can uh, uh, you can DM me if you like to be on the show. So at least uh, we we get to understand uh, some aspects of this lifestyle. Yes, and we will talk about it. It will be lit. So remember to subscribe. Remember to like and share. Until next time. Keep it, let's talk.